Hello everyone. Welcome back to another episode of The Infected. It is kind of early morning. It is just a little after seven. We have a lot of things we want to get done today. I want to make myself a better pokey stick or a better spear. Um, I want to get that done today. Uh, one that we can just, you know, have and not have to worry about it. Uh, we can sharpen it. So I want to make myself an iron one. I think it's iron. Maybe it's steel. Uh, let's just have a little look in our notebook. Itempedia. It's a steel spear. Um, we need one steel spear tip. Three sticks, five plant fiber. And to make that, we need a steel ingot. Crafted on the anvil. So we can do that. Um, what do we need after that? Three sticks, five plant fiber. Not horrible at all. Let's just go ahead and grab that. Five plant fiber. One, two, three sticks. Let's get up here. Make um, one piece of lead and one iron. That will give us a piece of steel, I think. Yes, steel alloy. And to take care of that, we just need to place it on the um, forge. And we'll get that refining and get all of that taken care of. What else do we have on us? Probably aluminum and cobalt. We are also working on a couple more of the wind turbines over here. We did finish up the one down here on the main end. So we should be doing pretty well with power. Um, I think we have about 40 spare um, right now. What do we have in our inventory? We have aluminum and cobalt. Probably should save some of that to make a couple of the um, electrical parts we're going to need today because we are going to be needing some of those. Let's take all of these nice things, get back inside, and hopefully that spear is ready. Or, sorry, hopefully the steel is ready. It is not. Okay, aluminum. Let's go ahead and put some of that away. We want to keep some of it. Cobalt, we probably have a little bit of room for that. Fragments, we have a couple of those. Iron, we did get some of that as well. Uh, don't think we needed four sticks. I think we only needed three. So let's put one of them away as well. And today we're going to be working on getting the cement mixer up and going. We're just going to make that way down here on the end. Let's go ahead and grab our um, bow. Get out here and hopefully take care of this Bambi. Where are you going? Kind Bambi girl. Shot you once in the rear end. Not good at all. Bad spot for an arrow, that's for sure. I have been working on getting some of the food in the... Um, greenhouse um, turn into canned food we're doing pretty good here not great but pretty good uh, let's see let's go ahead and get this thing placed over here I did go ahead and craft myself a bunch more of these planks so that's nice uh, we are ready to start building today we need a cement mixer um, probably an others mixer electrical parts mechanical parts iron ingots and screws very very expensive to craft but i think we should be okay with doing that uh, let's go ahead and place you right there and yeah we have a lot of things to get done electrical parts and mechanical parts not too bad but the iron ingots are not going to be great we have um, the oil extractor running we still need a lot of this as well hopefully now that steel spearhead is or that piece of steel is getting ready for the steel spearhead it is done let's go ahead and place one of you over here steel spear tip um do we craft that on the advanced workbench we are going to do that very lovely okay so we need lots of these okay we don't have lots of those where are we going to get lots of those? I hate really to do that. But we don't have much of a choice here. Let's 
Uh, let's get a few more of those. We need 20 of those. Oh dear. Using a lot of resources? That's okay. We need mechanical parts. So those are crafted, I think, on the advanced workbench. Uh, mechanical part. Yes. We need four of these, I think. But we're going to make five just to have them. Uh, we need copper. We need cobalt. Come on. We need plastic parts. One of the reasons why the oil is so important. Um, let's go ahead and get one of you. And let's take these 25 bark chips. I did not have that prepared. Uh, that was just luck, guys, that that happened. Okay, let's go ahead and make the electrical components that we need. And it's one plastic. One plastic, one cobalt, one copper. Okay, let's go ahead and take those. Doing pretty well. We can do this. Um, these are nearly completed. Uh, we're going to need 10 sand, 10 clay. We don't have a lot of clay. Let's go ahead and take these and put them up here as well. And we'll just put the other seven away in here for now. Let's go ahead and grab this if possible. And let's get down here and hopefully we need some screws. Copper. We need two copper. Let's go ahead and get the screws made here that we're going to need. I think it was 20 screws hopefully it was 20 screws if not we're gonna we're gonna have a few extra it was 10 screws that is okay I'm just gonna name this mixer oh dear caps lock is not your friend okay let's go ahead and accept that um, a bit foggy out this morning probably kind of cool out uh, October mornings here where I live are generally pretty cool uh, they look a bit like this which is okay by me I'm gonna put the clay in here and the sand I know we don't have this ready to go just yet we do need to put some power to it so let's um, get our let's put this away for now let's get the upgrade tool here Okay, let's get the bow out as well. Where are you at? Are you over here? Okay, where are you? Okay. I'm really glad they don't have enough sense to come in between the spikes and start hitting on the base. Very lovely. Okay, so we have our upgrade tool. We do need some wiring. We're going to need uh, probably a switch. Maybe a junction box. Uh, let's see. What do we need back here? Um, come on, placeables. Others. Uh, probably in power. Um, yes. We need a junction box. Just here. I'm trying to hide these as much as possible, guys. I'm not quite sure it's working out. But it is what it is. Um, there's not a lot we can do about these. The need for these things are just ridiculous. And um, we need a switch. Two electrical parts for that, guys. Come on. Maybe we won't build that right away. So this needs um, two cobalt, two copper, and two iron. We don't even have any iron. Two cobalt, two copper. 
and two iron. And we are out of iron. Completely out. So we're really going to have to turn off the oil extractor for now. Even though we desperately need this stuff. Uh, let's jump down here and turn it off for now. It's really sad that we don't have enough power to run everything. But we don't. There's not a lot we can do about that. Let's get over here and check on the crops. They need water. Let's go ahead and do that for now. Let's refill our water canteen as well. We are out of water. Let's drink what we need here. Refill this. Turn this off. Should be good. And everything should have plenty of water. It does. Okay. So. Let's get back over here. Okay, two cobalt, two copper. Drop those in there. Let's turn on the this thing, the um, stone grinder. Try to get some iron fragments going. So that we can at least make some iron if we need to. Uh, we don't even have enough oil to put in this thing to make any more gas. Uh, we don't have any gas in there. Let's get up here and check on the iron fragments. and Or, sorry, the iron ingots. See if those are ready to be placed. Get down here and get this uh, cement mixer up and going. Going to have to work on getting some of that done off camera as well. Uh, that takes forever to get that done. Um, a lot of sort of babysitting. Come on, what's the problem here? Okay, so we need our thing here. Oh dear. Cancel. Should have some wires. We can pull over here. Put you to you. And I don't like the look of that wire, but there's not really anything I can do about it, guys. Let's go ahead and turn this on. Um... and mix really probably do need a switch here I'm not even sure what this is even for I don't know why we need these junction boxes on everything just to get it to connect maybe there's something that I'm doing wrong but if there is I don't know how to fix it uh, just seems like nothing really works unless we have those junction boxes going on Okay, let's go ahead and get out our axe and do the same thing for it. Get it sharpened and, you know, ready to go again. Very lovely. Okay. So now we're going to have to worry about sand. We need to get the clay extractor going again as well. We do have a bit of biofuel that we can just throw in there now. Uh, ended up doing some fishing. I turned the fish um, I harvested the fish, turned it into biofuel in the crate. Just let it, you know, do its thing and hang out in there. And let's go ahead and turn this on. Okay. Um, this is doing its thing. Pick up the stick here. Okay. Let's get back in here, guys. We can do this. Okay, uh, we have this working. We'll be making um, 10 cement. Takes a ton. We need 90 of it to make a garage for, for our truck. Something else that I really want to work on, guys, is um, placing a couple of the fencing in this direction. I don't like that the Vambies are just able to you know, run over here. And do their thing and hit everything and just, you know, go home if they choose. I don't like that. Uh, way too low there, guys. Way too low. Okay, X and mouse wheel will let us raise that and lower it. Um, let's just go ahead and place you right there. And I'm going to have to raise this one as well. X and mouse wheel. I think I was trying to crouch a bit there. I 
I really probably should leave that open for a gate. Okay, that's hovering. We can't do that. Let's delete this one. And let's get back in here. Um, there's a chicken or a bird or something over there. Probably a chicken since I do hear one clucking. Let's lower this a bit so it doesn't look like it's floating. And the same thing just here. And there's no need really to put one out into the water. Okay, so in the center, just here, I'm going to delete that. Place a gate there. A small wooden gate will be fine. Okay, um, let's see if we need to raise this a bit. Let's go ahead and get that placed as well. And that will allow us to be able to um, get in and out over here to get some supplies. But then it will also give us the ability to block that off if we don't want to have to deal with any of the Vambies. Uh, this one seems a bit low. They could probably jump over that if they chose. Let's delete this one. And try that again. We might have to raise that one a bit. Um, let's see how that looks. I think that looks okay. I'm sure they're going to run around this. Potentially even over here as well. But we, we can put a spike there to kind of slow that down. Okay. So, now, let's get back in here. We're going to get some rope and some um, logs in just a minute. I don't know what that bird's doing. Looks like there's something seriously going on over there. Okay, we'll just let it do its thing. Let's take that. Let's get some sand and clay from upstairs again. Um, clay here, sand here, get back down there, get that going again. Got to keep this going if we want to be able to craft the garage pretty soon. Let's go ahead and get that mixing. Probably going to need more than just the one of those. Um, so we're going to have to work on that a bit as well. Okay, let's get the cart take it up here get some logs I did mean to get some rope but I simply forgot that let's go ahead and chop this tree down get it loaded into the cart get back down by the um, base and get some of these fences done um, there's some trees just above there that should be okay we don't need those anyway around the base take this okay let's get out here get started placing these guys that uh, takes six logs per so that's a lot it's gonna take a bit to get these completed okay there's a stick just here let's take the cart just up on the hill here Get some logs loaded into it. And let's chop down a big tree here. Okay. Let's take this back down the hill. Continue working on this.
Caramel. Okay. Do that number again. We're going to repeat the process until we at least get most of these guys built. <laughs> okay, so we did get injured by the Vambi. Really wasn't expecting one from that direction. I don't know why. Just wasn't expecting that at all. Okay. Let's continue just here. We're out of rope. Let's go get some more rope. Can't be out just yet. Or don't need to be out. Okay, let's do... Let's put a few things away that we don't need. You. And a lot of these things go down here. We can take that. Craft more rope. A um, couple of stone, a couple of screws and nails. put the sticks away over here the wiring away here as well as these items let's put some of this rope back over here let's get back here and drop the stone in here try to keep this going a bit come on okay All right, we have that completed. Let's get in here and see if we have four pieces of copper. Very hopeful that we do. Copper, one, two, three, and four. And we are out of copper. Okay. We still need a log for that. That is okay. There's just one lying right there. And not horrible at all. And we can leave that open for now because we don't have our spikes crafted yet. Uh, we could always move some of these out. Out here, I do want to have them kind of stick over into the water a bit. Like that. Okay, let's don't have them overlapping a ton. Not really a need for that. Okay, let's do this. Can't really tell how far over they're lapping without being in front of them. I don't really want that over into the gate. There we go. I think that'll be okay. go down here do that we can also place these even through the fencing I think uh, maybe not at least most of these will be will be upgraded as well um, these spikes Shouldn't take but one or two more. And one more should be good. We're also going to finish upgrading the rest of the base as well. 
don't really think that, that is necessary, but it's okay. Okay. And we can always move this back here. Just to have it kind of close to the base. So that nothing is really destroying anything right there. Okay, let's go ahead and close that off now because we are very vulnerable. Okay, what did we come in here for? We came in here for more sand and clay. We also came to put some things away. Let's go ahead and put that in there. Put the bark chips away up here. There's a deer over there. That's okay. Sand here. Clay here. Let's get that mixing as well. We don't have a ton of it yet. We only have 20 pieces. But that's okay. We will manage to get there. Let's get a crate for that. Just because we don't have one. Go ahead and place that storage just here. Eh, we'll place it right here. Not a huge deal at all. Let's go ahead and get you and you in there. Very lovely. We are definitely making some progress today. I uh, hope you guys are okay with this being sort of closed off. I do think it adds a bit of safety because the town is just up on the hill there. And I think that's why we get so many Vambies here. And I'm okay with being able to walk around freely out here, guys, without needing to jump over the spikes all the time. Very hopeful that we can start getting enough um, steel or iron ingots here. So that we can start working on that big gate. I'm going to harvest this. Because we need it for the rack. Or for biofuel, sorry. Right, let's go ahead and pick this one up. Pick this one up as well. And then we should be able to get out of here fairly easily. Okay, we are really out of stamina. Let's get in here and drop these off in the cart. Let's see what's going on. Are we very, very hungry? It appears we're sort of hungry. Let's eat that. Let's have another one. We're going to have to butcher this bear. Because we are going to need the food. Okay, where are you, Bambi? Number four. Okay. There's my arrow. Let's go ahead and take that back with us. Because we need it worse than the ground does. That is for sure. Okay. Um, I do think I'm going to move that pot. If possible. Might have to move the spike back out. Definitely appears that it does not want to give that up. Okay. And... Go ahead and take this. Let's move this again to right there. I don't want the base to take any damage, so I do think I'm going to place a few of these spikes around something like that, you know, just right up against the base so that it really isn't taking any damage. 
and maybe a bit more here. Probably will continue building those off camera. Uh, I'm going to have to have a bunch up here as well. So I'm going to have to work on building those also. Um, not a huge deal right now considering we don't have, you know, um, a door there to keep anything out. But um, with that being said, guys, we have done a bit of work today, haven't we? Um, I do want to build the garage just kind of right in here i will be trying to get that placed as well i know it's huge i know that but i do want it to kind of close to the base a bit um maybe maybe i'll move the truck and just kind of put it like right there Maybe we'll do that, but I will work on placing that off camera, of course, for sure. And hopefully we can start building that in the next episode or two. I think that would be lovely to do. Let's go ahead and drop that in there as well. And I'm going to have to do a bit of hunting. I know. I'm surprised by that myself. Let's go ahead and butcher the bear and call it a day here, guys. I do want to thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I really do appreciate all of your support on this channel and on this series as well. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope you're looking forward to future episodes. And I can't wait to catch you guys in the next one. Until then, have yourselves a wonderful, wonderful day.